Xanadu welcomes its new duplicant. Ross is a prodigious artist who has dedicated his life to painting and sculpture. But he has been printed with a backup medical degree, in case the whole art thing doesn't work out. While mopping up water, Jeeves discovered the base of a geyser nearby a large iron ore deposit. The chlorine-rich environment will delay exploration. While installing wiring for the oxygen diffusers, there was some minor structural damage done to the living area. Specifically, the bathroom is missing a wall, and the mess hall needs a floor. This tantalizing door to nowhere, will keep the duplicants in suspense. Although Robbie has been making progress with research, he has been missing his wheel. Also, he doesn't like the hat covered in pointless Christmas lights. Hopefully, the pod will produce another duplicant to take over. There are insufficient farm tiles for the fungal spores being collected from the swamp. This is an excellent opportunity to expand the pit. Clay and slime can sometimes hide fungal spores, and also, deadly disease. Polluted water from washing basins is used to grow thimble reeds, which will supply the colony with luxurious textiles. The environment is not an important concern in Xanadu, and this act of recycling is purely incidental. Caring for mushrooms will not satisfy Mike for long. They are hazardous to maintain and there is a distinct lack of reciprocation. Eventually, we should build him a stable so that he can tame some hatches for the colony to exploit. For now, a spot has been selected and will be excavated.
Thank you for watching the video, and your support of this channel. Goodbye, until the next cycle.